Hello everybody, uh, Ren here. Uh, update on that old gas station that I've been reporting on here for the last couple weeks. Now, I'm going to start off by saying that you got to lead by example. And I hope I've done that in the past. Now, when it comes to making mistakes, yeah, I do. And I admit it, just like I'm going to admit it right now. And I think it's very important that... Uh, something like this happens, you know, you go ahead and fess up to it like I am, you know. Like I said, lead by example. And I, I hope I've done that in the past. And uh, like I'm doing now, I'm fessing up. Okay, uh, you know, I jumped the gun on saying that, uh, you know, that the, the company that uh, that you saw, the pictures that, that uh, came before this here video, yeah, uh, you know, I, I, you know, I told, I said that, you know, they, they lied to me about, yeah, they're going to knock it down. And then I came back and with a picture that you saw now, it's all painted up, looks nice. And I was saying, hey, wait a minute, man, you know, I thought they were going to knock it down, but they just put a fresh coat of paint on it. So what's up? So guess what? Today on my ride, I seen those guys there working. So I went over and talked to him. I asked him, hey, what's going on with this building? Uh, I thought you said you were going to knock it down. So check it out. First, I'd like to say that, you know, I used to paint houses around Pomona, you know, Lincoln Park area there, you know, historical homes and stuff for the, this painting company. And that was back in the 1970s, late 90s, or about mid 70s, yeah. And anyway, you know, you know, this lead paint thing, you know, uh, back then, uh, I'm pretty sure people were still using it, but we never had to do what these guys had to go through. Now, what they were doing with that new fresh paint of coat or paint, that isn't really paint. That's kind of like uh, all that old lead paint that they had scraped off that, you know, this, guy, this gentleman was telling me that uh, they scraped it off, they bagged all that stuff. But the stuff they couldn't scrape off, this paint or whatever sealer would take care of that. So, you know, when they do knock the garage down, unfortunately, that's what's going to take place. They are going to knock it down. That all that stuff that they couldn't get will stay there, you know, instead of flying all over the air and stuff. And, of course, there'll be somebody there with a, with a water hose. Like they would do in any, any uh, tear down, you know, keep the dust down. But with this paint or whatever it is, sealant will help keep what they couldn't get there instead of, you know, up in the air. So that's what that was all about. It looked like a new paint job. <laughs> yeah, I just jumped the gun on it and assumed. Another lesson, don't ever assume that this is taking place. Yeah, well, just got a little uh, overexcited the moment there. Uh, but anyway, that's what's going to take place with the garage. I talked to that company, the guy, and uh, he said uh, they are going to knock it down. And they're just kind of putting up finishing touches of uh, making sure that they're uh, covering their bases. So when they go and knock the building down, that uh, all that old paint, lead paint, will be flying in the air and stuff. So. Anyway, that's what's up with the gas station, old gas station. It's not going to be around very long. And unfortunately, uh, yeah, it's going to be torn down. You know, I also told them that, uh, you know, as soon as they finished up work there uh, a couple of weeks ago, a week and a half ago, you know, they had to remove all the boards off the windows there so they can do their job. But as soon as they got done the first time and left for a few days, boom. Those homeless just jumped right back in that building. It's just like the next day or so I went by there and they were there hanging out inside the building. And even though he said they came back, there was a couple of people in there again, you know. So, you know, it, it's sad to see go, but then it's a nuisance. And I can understand, uh, you know, nobody wants to buy the building and do anything with it. I had made a video about how it would be pretty cool to make like a spokes cafe, like a bike stop for people traveling, 
you know, from wherever they can come there and stop, take a rest, need to work on their bike or whatever, you know. But anyway, I thought that would be cool, but unfortunately, uh, you know, well, with days, you know, now they don't even want to, I guess, I'll run on your bike, so what the hell. So anyway, that's the update on the gas station. Just want to let you know what's going on. So anyway, yeah, the gas stations are located on West 2nd Street, there, uh, right next to uh, Memorial Park there on the west side down the corner. That's where this gas station is at. Okay, this is Ren fessing up. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm giving you an update on everything. So anyway, you know, like always, you take care and uh, you take care of those ones you love. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bye.